Jonathan Gavoni of DraftExpress.com. We're here with Jamil Warney in New York City. Jamil, how uh, not very far from where you uh, went to school. Well, how's it like working out out here in New York? Uh, it's great. Uh, it's convenient from where I live and uh, where I'm staying at in Stony Brook, New Jersey. So I'm happy to be working out here a lot and uh, hopefully it's getting better. For people who are watching this video that might not know too much about you, what can you tell us about your background? Three-time player of the year at my conference. Uh, we finally went to the tournament in Stony Brook. Um, all-time leading scorer, all-time leading rebounder, all-time leading blocks, um, and just uh, someone who just wanted to improve every day uh, and achieve a dream. We saw you have a lot of success at the college level as a rebounder, as a shot blocker, scoring around the basket, even making some mid-range jumpers. How much of that is going to be part of your game moving forward, and, and how much do you need to add to you know, continue to, to grow as the competition level gets, gets stiffer? Uh, I mean, I got a lot of work to uh, put in, but rebound, I feel like rebounding translating uh, to the next level, so I feel like that skill for me is elite, and I feel like just me wanting to compete on the defensive end is just a start of being a good defender, and just everything else will work for itself as I keep on improving as the years go. So, but I feel like I start off with uh, elite skill and rebounding, so just uh, starting off with that and just keep on improving uh, my skill set. How much does the evolution of basketball, how much does that help you with your style of play, being able to do so many different things on the floor? Uh, well, it works, it works a lot uh, with the new age in basketball, a lot of small, a lot of small ball, but it just, you, have to, you have to have a good skill to make yourself fit in that. So I feel like rebounding for me can help me go on the court now in small ball, and I feel like I can, I can defend some positions. So you gotta have those two skill sets and obviously a, a decent offensive set to make yourself used in that small ball. So I feel like I'm heading in the right direction. Do you feel like you still have something left to prove here in the in the pre-draft process going into these next five weeks or so? You're gonna be able to you know match up against some of the top prospects in, in the NBA draft. You, is there still something left to be shown for, for the NBA team? Uh, yeah, I mean, even though I had a good college career, people are going to just assume that it was because I'm a smaller program with inferior talent. But I just know that uh, I'm confident in myself. And I know I can play with anyone. So just proving with this big chip on my shoulder, not getting complacent, and just showing the, the teams that uh, I can play in this level. Great stuff, man. Thank you so much.